Hello, good morning. Happy Monday. Just got home. Sonny's first ski this morning. I just got home from workout class. What? What? Why? I don't know what to do this. Um, oh my god, look how cute this little bird feeder is. Ignore my messy window. I think Arlo put yogurt on it. But this is a little bird feeder I got yesterday in the mail. We installed it. Arlo was like, <laughs> we had a we had one of Scott's coworkers over. And we're installing this thing, waiting for, or I think it was after dinner. No, it was before dinner. Scott like cooked a good dinner last night, but Arlo's like out the window, he's like, caca, caca. <laughs> Like trying to call in the birds like, hey birds, I've got food for you. And it's funny because Arlo whistles like, whoo, whoo, when Winnie's outside, you know, and we're like whistling for her to come in. He's like, whoo, whoo, come on Winnie, whoo, whoo. So, I got two other packages though. Let's open them together. We're gonna get some breakfast going. Which I did no meal prepping this week. So I'm gonna leave that for tomorrow though because Scott has golf. So I don't have to cook dinner. I mean, I do for Arlo and I, but I don't have to cook like dinner, you know? So I am, I know what this is. I am gonna do some serious reorganization when I switch over my spring wardrobe. I haven't done it yet because honestly, you guys, we still have days where it's 40 degrees. So I, I got these and I thought these would be perfect because they're super little for my leggings and workout stuff and it'll take up like a small, only a super small little spot in my drawer so I can put some other stuff in them. Um, so like my workout tops and my leggings. And then if I like these, I'll order two more, but I wanna kinda see how they like stand up in the thing because they're kinda flimsy. Um, but I ordered that and I've got some other stuff coming too so we can get our life a little bit more organized because I just kinda feel like <clears throat> There's actually like a list on my phone of things I've been putting off doing that I kind of just need to pick a day and just get it done. Do y'all have those things? Like the, like I was reclining the couch the other day and I just saw all the like food and crap in the side cushions. Judge me if you want, but like that, uh, I've been meaning to wash my sneakers for a while. I have to depot a couple plants and that. There's just things that I need to do, an organization in my closet. Like there's just things that I've been putting off for like, longer than I care to admit. And it's just time that I get my life together. So, anyway, I placed a Zara hold order. Um, it's not like a big one, so I'm not gonna do like a full video about it, but ooh, I um, placed a little order because the dress that I got from Lulu's was a fail. And I saw this one and I was like, oh, that's cute. So let's, oh gosh, here we go. Let's see. Well, there was a couple dresses that I thought were cute. This one I thought is so adorable. I always get their dresses in like a medium or a large because they always run really small. This one, like with the little neck, a little rope detailing, I just thought this would be cute for spring. But this is the dress that I think I might wear for, I need to try it on obviously, for the um, <clears throat> derby party. Cause Scott's wearing pink and blue and then I really like green. So I think I might wear that. I'm excited, I need to try it on obviously. And then this is the whole reason I actually placed this order. This isn't as nice as I thought it was gonna be. I'm gonna need to try it on. Um, Naomi, I follow her on Instagram. Put this on and it looks so cute. I'll put off this little crocheted bit thing. This might be a little booby. We're gonna have to try that out. And then I did get a pair of shorts. I've never tried a pair of shorts from Zara but these looked really cute. I got them in a size 40, because I'm sick of just like Zara's pants running like so small. And you know what? I honestly think they're gonna fit me perfectly. But how cute are those? They're like the perfect length. I don't know, obviously I need to try them on. Um, let's eat some breakfast because I'm hungry, but happy Monday. Okay, it's kind of short, but I think this is the winner. It's longer in the back, and I'll probably wear some little like shorts underneath it. Just to be safe, I don't have anything. <laughs> done and I look kind of crazy, but I think this is it. It's cute, it's very summery, springy. And then I'll go with the pink to match the pink in the dress, um, like such. Some heels, and then Scott's wearing like pink and blue. So obviously I have a lot of green in here, but there's blue and pink, so I think it still matches. 
still gonna be cute, so. Okay, I love this dress. I think this is so cute. It is kind of see-through, so keep that in mind. Um, I probably would wear like nippies and, I mean, you can see my underwear through it, but um, nude underwear, but I love the pleating and this little rope tie and the buttons are like um, crocheted. They actually function, but there's a zipper to get in and out of on the back. But I think this is such a cute dress. The colors are pretty muted with this like caramely color with the blue. I just think it's so pretty. Am I in my dress era? I love high necks, like anything with a high neck. So here's the top. Um, I like it. I feel like I need to style it a couple different ways to see if it's like a keeper. It's a very like stretchy material. It's interesting. So it like smushes my boob in. The back is so freaking cute too. I think this would be just adorable with like obviously these denim shorts. Obviously my hair done a little bit differently. Um, these shorts, I love these, but I do need to get the next size down. I got these in a 40 just because I'm sick of being like <laughs> not fitting in their shorts um, or their pants in general. So I'm going to try to get these in a 38 so they fit a little bit better. But I love the length. I love everything about these. Um, yeah, they're super cute. And the back of this top is adorable with the little tie. So I'm debating on this. What size did I get the top in? I feel like it just puckers a little bit here. I guess I could. No, I can't. girl. <laughs> nope. Okay, and then this is the little crocheted top. I don't know if I love this either. It's really cute. It's really nice detailed. I don't like how it has this thick band here. I feel like it needs to be tucked in, but it's got this cute scalloped. I wish this ran all the way down. Obviously, I would wear it with bra, and I probably wouldn't wear it with this thing. I just feel like it gives me just like straight square vibes. So, I don't know if I love it. I need to wash my hair. Um, I'm sitting here, and I just placed another support. <laughs> So for order, um, one of y'all influenced me, and they influenced myself, um, gosh, my hair is so greasy, I literally watched it the other day, I'm so annoyed, um, I used the Divi shampoo and conditioner, which I like, but I feel like, again, it leaves me so freaking greasy, like, in a day, but I'm gonna try the day today. Gosh, I wanted to try it. I literally, when I was shampooing my hair the other day, I was like, oh, girl, you missed your opportunity because I wanted to be able to try it. But anyway, I can still try it. But I wanted to let you know before the sale. Say hello to my little friend. No one invited her, but but she invited her. Go away. Um. Anyway, what was I saying? Oh, one of y'all said you love and you think I would love the Summer Friday Hyaluronic Tinted whatever it is. So I bought it. And while I was buying it, I also realized that I didn't buy the Summer Friday lip balm when I was placing my first order. I don't know how I canceled that out of my car. I don't know what happened, but I didn't. And then I also ordered the Armani Luminous Silk because I wanted to buy that so many times and I'm just like, Bleh. and I've never had the right color for me. I have a color that's like, like an eight, like what was I thinking? Um, so I bought it and we'll see. Because I've never been somebody to return stuff, but I'm going to be someone that returns stuff if I don't like it. Because I want to try it. I want to see it. I'm sick of being scared to try stuff because I won't like it because I'll waste my money when I should just take advantage of the return policy. I know what it is, you know? I think I've returned one thing it's for in my entire life. But anyway, um, and it's only because it literally gave me a horrible reaction. But tell me why this is the case. Why can you try out a foundation for like a month? and then return it because it doesn't work. But why can you not do the same with clothes? Like why can't I try a pair of jeans for like a week to make sure I like it and it goes with everything and then still return it? But the t you can only return stuff with like tags unwashed. How is that the case? Why is it not the same? Like because sometimes I'll buy something and I'm like, yes, I need this, you know? And then I'm like, never mind, I don't need it. Wear it once, never want to wear it again. How come I can't do that? Can you? No, I'm pretty sure you can only return new stuff. Anyway, just small thoughts in my brain. Um, oh, I painted my nails yesterday. So pretty. It's not as like bluish, deepish bluish as what I wanted, but it's still pretty. And Arlo is the first person to always be like, I love your nail polish. <laughs> my biggest fan, my main man. Um, 
I was gonna film today, but since my hair is disgusting, I don't wanna like put heat on it to then wash it tonight. So we're gonna just do a little switcheroo and we'll do a lot of different house stuff. I'm gonna still film, but not like a sit down makeup thing. And I feel like this thing should be smothered in a pimple patch the whole day. Cause I don't like her. So yeah, that's the plan. I just wanted to say hi. I'm probably gonna vlog in and out today. Um, I also got my oy, my little Maturium order. They shipped this so freaking fast. And has anyone else been like seriously disappointed with Amazon and or Target shipping stuff that's like not properly packaged? Like I get this doesn't come in a box, so it's like really easy to be ruined. Well, finally they decided to use a zip tie <laughs> and tape um, but they still didn't put any padding in this box. So I just had like three things just like rolling and jolling. Thankfully it came unbroken, but the Naturium body wash, I'm almost out of it. And then I bought two of the lotions because I go through the lotions obviously quicker than I go through the body wash because you need more. Um, but I got that. What else? And that's it. I think that's it. So I've got some behind the scenes filming to do and then just going to kind of pick up a little bit. Like I said, we had a friend over yesterday. Um, and so we kind of just didn't do a ton and Scott golfed on Saturday and well, we went to see the new Mario movie, um, which was fun. Arlo liked it and what else, what else, what else, what else? Did a hot yoga class on Saturday, kicked my tush. Um, I'm really trying to try as many different classes as I can. Um, I'm so excited though for June, hopefully it's June when the Pilates studio opens up. Um what oh and then um oh my god how cute they return they <laughs> released ghost um ninja turtle pre-workouts that's so dang cute um we just saw the preview for the ninja turtle movie as well but that's it i haven't really tried any of my makeup from sephora i kind of want to wait until i get everything to do a girl talk and do that so i need to stop touching this um okay bye so wash my face put a pimple creme on let's go organize these leggings and then the rest of my life because we're kind of in shambles but i've kind of come to the realization that's just how i am at this point so this is what our drawer currently looks like not much going on but i do have all that laundry to do so let's organize what we do have and then get this stuff put in here because most of it's workout clothes hey miss crankers hi the bubbles <laughs> So, so far so good. I really like the, like the way it works. I have all of these leggings. I still like them. I need to start wearing them again because I just feel like I haven't worn them in a hot minute, but I still remember loving them. So I need to reach for these more often. I just love my CRZ Butterlux. So we're going to do leggings. And then I was hoping that I would, well, I forgot about these. So I think I'm going to get another one of these for my tops, like my sports bra things um over here and then even the other one to put like my, my shorts in so i'm gonna get two more all right so there we have it i obviously have one more pair of leggings that i wore today that needs to go back there but everything else is set these i want to put into my little dividers i can probably roll up and do two in each one because they're kind of smaller like fold them up like that and stick two in each one or just do one and then um the other one goes with shorts and um whatnot it's going to be kind of tight because these are going to probably just slide in the side but i still think that this is going to help keep me freaking way more organized so for my lunch i actually pre-shredded up some lettuce because i used that little like the meal prep that i used last week i finished that up today and i wanted it over lettuce because i've been liking to have it as a salad and i was out of pre-shopped lettuce Oh, I need to do the dishes. Fun! Um, so I decided to prep that all out and we'll use it for tonight's dinner. But my little recipe tonight 
It is her chicken tzatziki bowls. Great chicken tzatziki bowls what I'm making. So let's start with the chicken um, marinade. So I need the garlic, chicken, olive oil, shallots, paprika, oregano, all the things. And then we're supposed to marinate it. Cuckoo, chew, boogaroo. I think I'm air frying it. I don't think I'm having in it. A banana tonight. So let's go ahead and get my marinade working and then chop up this chicken. Six cloves of garlic, girl. You gonna be fresh tonight. Do we have to water herbs every single day and I have no idea? Because these things look limp as can be if I don't water them every day. And the minute you water them, My chicken marinating over here and then I have all my little veggies chopped up over here some red onion cucumber tomato dill my salads ready to go I put lentils in the finger rice cooker we'll see how that goes tzatziki hummus feta and I'm gonna do um, falafel as well 